Do you think there is really such a thing as free real estate leads? Well, since you've started watching this video, you probably are at least somewhat skeptical. That's great and kudos to you for being at least skeptical. And in this video, I will bust the myth of free real estate leads, but also tell you which ones are often considered as free and why they're actually not. Someone telling you there are free ways to get real estate leads either isn't honest or hasn't thought it through yet. Why? When we dive deeper into what free means, we can see it's not as straightforward as it seems at first glance. You know, there is more to costs than money. Besides money, there are many more indirect costs. The most significant cost in so-called free methods is your time. Whether you're engaging on social media, writing blog posts or networking, it's all time consuming. Let's take YouTube videos for example. Many consider it a way to get free real estate leads. Well, this video is different since it's an experiment with less editing. But before all in all for each minute you're watching right now, it took me 30 to 60 minutes of production time. Meaning ideation, research, thumbnails, filming and editing. So a 7 minute video would take me between 3.5 and 7 hours of work. That's 3.5 and 7 hours you could have theoretically worked at a fast food chain earning minimum wage. And by the way, many YouTube influencers who only rely on ad revenue earn around minimum wage per hour if you take all this into consideration. What I'm telling you is that many forget that these free real estate lead gen methods cost you an opportunity, aka opportunity costs. Or let's put it differently, the $84 you could have earned at a fast food chain restaurant you could have invested in paid ads or another faster direct method and seen immediate results. On the other hand, YouTube and other free content marketing channels always take time and the feedback you get whether something works is pretty delayed. Let's get on to the next cost of free real estate lead generation. To effectively use the methods I will discuss soon you often need a certain level of skill or knowledge. Let's take writing compelling content, understanding social media algorithms or again producing YouTube videos for instance. That's not inherently easy. You might need to invest time and perhaps money in learning these skills. It may take a while, several months or even years to get better at these skills. And if you don't want to do it yourself, you will need to do, wait a second, <laughs> yeah spend money doesn't sound free to me and finally there is another type of cost involved in getting free real estate leads even if you're not paying for advertising there might be indirect costs for example hosting an open house might not cost you in ad dollars but there are expenses relating to related to staging refreshments and time spent or for instance door knocking yes it sounds as if it is a free lead gen method but then we have again the time spent going from house to house. You also likely need a car to get to the neighborhood. This means you have wear and tear and the gas you put into your car. And what about the tranquilizer shots you have to buy for the dogs that don't let you reach the doors you want to knock. Now what are these real estate lead chain methods that so many consider as free? Well you can get free real estate leads via outbound marketing, digital and offline. That's text message prospecting, cold email outreach, calling, expired listings, a subcategory of cold calling, cold calling fistbos, door knocking. By the way, here you also have costs to get the contact information of the prospects. They are often called leads, but they aren't. Why? Strictly speaking in marketing, leads are people that have shown basic interest in your services. But these contacts haven't. There is only a high likelihood they may be interested in what you have to offer when you first contact them. Next we have free real estate leads via inbound marketing, digital and offline. That's content marketing on social media, posting on Facebook, YouTube, TikTok, Instagram, etc. Content marketing, publishing blog articles, videos, downloadable white papers free giveaways, etc. Answering questions on social media, forums, Quora, Reddit, etc. On-page SEO, webinars with strategic partners, guest posting, yet not Google's favorite anymore, 
organizing housewarming parties, organizing an open house event, organizing educational events. Here you often have to deal with a huge time investment, indirect costs and need patience until you see results. Then some consider database marketing as a way to get free real estate leads. That's email marketing and nurturing campaigns, for example, past clients. Wait a second, who paid for acquiring these past clients? You can now send emails to again. And then there is sphere of influence marketing. That's as close as it gets to free. Here you only pay with your time when you communicate. And the next and final method some consider free is referral marketing. That's partnering with retirement home projects, partnering with probate attorneys, partnering with divorce attorneys, strategically getting referred to others by satisfied past clients, using referral real estate lead companies, take part as a guest, in an open house, going to non-real estate event networks and becoming a member of the local chamber of com commerce. The hidden costs here are again your time investment but also a certain reputation you may have to build first before others are eager to refer you to clients. By the way, if you want to get my free course revealing the overlooked foundation factor for your lead chain success, you can find the link in the description. Oh, and well, talking about real estate leads, you may also want to check out the next video.